We all know what it's like to work for a self-serving leader, the kind that thinks they have all the brains and everyone in the organization is there to serve them. It's not very fun or motivating for anyone, and it isn't the way to get results from your people. In today's business world, we need a new leadership model, one that values people and results. It's called servant leadership. It's not a new concept. It was started back in the 60s by Robert Greenleaf, who was the first one to come up with the idea that you can serve and lead at the same time. It's a concept I've been fascinated by ever since I actually met Robert Greenleaf. Margie and I spent a weekend with him at Ohio University, which was our first teaching job, and he was just an amazing human being. Uh, and ever since I met Bob and learned about servant leadership, what I've really realized is that it's the foundation for all the leadership development programs that I've worked on over the years because they're all based on servant leadership. There are two parts to servant leadership. The first part is all about vision and direction and goals. It's the leadership part of servant leadership and that's got to be driven by the hierarchy. It doesn't mean you can't involve people in determining that, but vision and direction and goals got to come there because leadership is about going somewheres. Now, once that part of servant leadership is taken care of, now you philosophically turn that pyramid upside down and you move to the second part of servant leadership, the servant part, where you're there really for the people. How can you help them accomplish their goals? How can you help them win? It's all about serving them. And those two characteristics are really so powerful. And you know, I've just released my latest book, Servant Leadership in Action. In it, we've compiled stories from 44 of the most celebrated servant leaders, including Marshall Goldsmith, Simon Sinek, Brene Brown, Patrick Lencioni, and so many others. As I like to say, leadership isn't about you, it's about your people. It's about how you get the most out of your people so they not only perform well, but enjoy coming to work every single day.